Okay. okay I'm gonna try. Try and capture you. Okay, that's good enough. Wait, no, it's not. I'm gonna use one needle arm. There we go. Luckily, I have a few Pokeballs. And the game glitches. <laughs> I cause glitches everywhere I go. Yeah, I got dual... Double bl dual blade. You know what that means, Jiri? Name them? No, you. It's not up to me to name. Yeah, it's not up to me to name them. Chat and people in VC name them. Um, I'll read his Pokedex entry as well what it, as what it turns into. The complex attack patterns of its two swords are unstoppable, even f of an opponent greatly accomplished at sword play. At sword play. Yeah, it can turn. It turns into a sword that carries a shield in its hand. What are you naming it? Uh, I oh yeah, I forgot. I named a Pokemon after you. Oh gosh! It's not a snake. I, it was a it was a Edratini that's new. It's like it's like electric electric water. <laughs> so technically, well, it's not gonna be a snake looking thing forever. Oh yeah. Mm. The name. What will Jiri name the the swords? I'm bad at naming. <laughs> I, I really. I can think of is aggressive. Do it. That's not a good name. <laughs> aggressive. Okay. Oh no. There we go. Aggressive is its name. Aggressive was transferred to someone's PC. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded more like you transferred aggression into the PC. <laughs> oh, look, it's Jerry. <laughs> I am not every snake. <laughs> I thought it was a snake. <laughs> Oh shit. <laughs> Go oh whoa. <laughs> Use magnitude. I just realized there are Pokemon in the Pokemon universe that can create natural disasters. That's terrifying. You just realized that's a thing? Yeah, like, you can get any normal Pokemon, like, just go and catch it and create any natural any natural disaster you want. Hold on, I'll, I'll, I'll be back. Fucking Discord bitch. Oh. Kept cutting me off, you fucking asshole. <laughs> just need to get this Pokemon level 30. Then I'm... Then I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> I'm guessing taking it on the next gem, I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot, this game also has cults. What? <laughs> it's been a while since we played this game, Jerry, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. 
I also forgot I used to say how I would consume Pokemon Souls in this series. <laughs> For sustenance. <laughs> Holy shit, it's a Lugia. <laughs> I found Jury's father. <laughs> right. <laughs> what? You're magical. <gasps> oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Jury, do you believe I can catch Lugia? No, but believe in yourself or something. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot. Okay, do uh, uh, Jerry for. For aggressive, am I allowed to keep it? Keep what? The Pokemon, aggressive. Yeah, why? I forgot, another rule of this series was that I had to ask whether or not I can, I'm allowed to catch the Pokemon. Oh! <gasps> I forgot! Am I allowed to catch this Lugia? You can try, but I don't think you'll succeed. Damn it! <laughs> That's the last one, so now it dies. Oh yeah, I also found out, uh, Nom's actually very useful, because apparently they can't be poisoned. They can be hit by poison moves, but they can't be poisoned. Oh, that's very useful! Yeah, because when a Pokemon kept trying to use poison powder, uh, powder, it says that they were unable to do it on them. Holy fucking shit, this is... This is... This is... Um... That's Charizard! <laughs> that is... That is a murder Charizard. That is bone Charizard. It's a dead Charizard. <laughs> you know what? Considering how it looked before, I can't even argue with that joke. <laughs> that is a Magmortar. <laughs> they changed Magmortar. Magmatar was supposed is it is supposed to live in lava and everything, but they changed it in this game to make them a scuba diver. You know what? If it, if nothing else, it's a very creative look. Yeah. Let's see. Go Alphonse, my strongest Pokemon. This may be a problem. <laughs> Alright, Alphonse. Uh, stab this scuba diver of your sword. <laughs> Don't die. Alphonse has a lot of blossoms on them. Yeah, it's actually Trevenant. But they changed it. Oh, Trevenant looks a little nicer. Yeah, I can... Reason. I can show you a close look at my Pokemon in a moment. Okay. Ooh, they got Crunch now. It's better than Bite. Awesome. Good job, Nom. I believe in you, even though you almost died. 
You know, considering it has bite and crunch, I get its name now. <laughs> Here is Nom, who's apparently a shiny. I don't even know what the original's supposed to look like. Probably green. Yeah. Here's fat fuck. <laughs> Here's Angie. I really like Angie's design. You know what it reminds me of, Ajiri? What? A burning Godzilla. From Godzilla vs. Destroya. Oh. It does look like it. In a way. I'm not even sure if you know what Burning Godzilla looks like, Jerry. No, I don't. Alright, hold on. Alright, copy image. Go to Discord. Stream planning. Paste. Send in. There you go. It's just me, I see similarities between the two. What do you think? Oh, that's Burning Godzilla. Yep. I still see the resemblance, but... Ah. Uh, there's Eat Everyone. Oh, whoa. <laughs> uh. And Alphonse, the one you like. Instead of it being a, a ghost grass type, it is now a fairy fighting type. I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> Especially since we know what Trevenant is. It's a ghost of a child. <laughs> in a tree. <laughs> Technically, uh, fey mythology includes ghosts, so it's not that, it's just... Ah. Uh. That is, yeah. When a bootleg, not bootleg, when a fan version, fan game accidentally gets mythology better than Pokemon. Yeah. I also have another, po a more quick one PC that we should look at. Since we haven't played it in a while. Right. Let's open this. Move Pokemon. Here we have Plague. It's supposed to be. Uh, Why is Plague adorable? I don't know. That bothers me. <laughs> the adorable also Plague. Why do they have wings when they have a shell? Don't question it. Isn't that saying they have double the shell? <laughs> Maybe. Oh yeah, this is one I think you named. Believe you. <laughs> I did not name that. I don't know who did, but it wasn't me either. I don't know who oh. named that. We got Mind Reader. Who's apparently wearing Lucario Knight, <laughs> the Mega Stone for Lucario. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Dom is wearing an expert belt. Okay, let me take that. Up oh, here's Jiri. What? Water electric? Yep. That exists. Wait, aggressive's holding a deep sea scale? <laughs> that is a high quality item! Why? <laughs> oh, yeah, this is Metagross, as you can tell. Yeah. <laughs> this is Jenner. <laughs> you know what? 
It's a ditto, it makes sense. And here's MUI Pikachu. <laughs> You did that just to piss off you, didn't you? Maybe. <laughs> oh. Let's see. I think there was a Pokemon I saw earlier that, that you missed that I thought had a really cool design. don't know where it was though. There are so many Pokemon in this game. I feel like this is kind of what Pokemon should have been doing instead of getting more fancy and fancy. Yeah. Huh. Apparently I murdered the God of Death. Was it? Okay, it, my game glitched for a second. <laughs> Wait, I met all of these and murdered them apparently. <laughs> Is it? No, not you, not you. Stop glitching, game, please. Oh, wait, I wonder if I can just search the name. Oh. That did not help. You just put me towards that goddamn beginning. I didn't hit start search. There we go. Okay, now there's no way I can't find it. If the game would stop glitching for five seconds. I think it's because I'm also uh, exporting a video that is also doing a little glitchy. But it's fine. It's still running perfectly fine. <laughs> there we go. It should have. Appeared. I mean, I didn't catch it, but I killed it. So it there it is. Look at this thing. That. That is something that exists. <laughs> yeah, that's supposed to be the heat more, which is supposed to be that, uh. Fuck, that Pokemon that goes after the middle ants. And now they've turned into this thing. I think that is metal poison now. Yeah. <laughs> and we get no information. Because <laughs> I killed it. Because <laughs> I didn't have any Pokeballs. I wanted to capture it, but I had no Pokeballs. So it had to die. Oh yeah, I sent something to Hatchet about the, um, chapter one. I realized at the beginning, we didn't even describe what my character looks like at the beginning. <laughs> so it was up to interpretation as to what I look like. You know like. what? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we didn't even that do that. My story describes them better? <laughs> yeah. Uh... 
Does that mean you need to add more detail to chapter one at the beginning? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Nom only needs one more level. And then the murdering can cease. Oh, you know what's actually one thing that's disturbing about the first generation Pokemon games? Um, after you go on the boat, uh, facing blue, I think his name is called, or Gary, whatever you decide to call him, um, he has his Raticate while on the boat, but after you fight him, uh, <laughs> he no longer has that Raticate after, after you leave the boat and everything. You find out when he goes to Lavender Town, he, he is at Raticate's grave. Which means that last battle you do killed his Raticate. Uh. <laughs> it's it's canon and it is so fucked. It is so fucked. Actually, with the first game, is that what you're talking about? I think it was like red, blue, and green. Yeah, it's red, blue, not green. green All right. Green, Holy red. shit! <laughs> but that's actually not canon. You did not kill the Raticate. Oh, wait a minute. All I know is that I, I was remember being told that Raticate, his Raticate died. And that's yeah, that's a myth. He just swapped it out of his uh, party. What the fuck? Why did people keep talking about that? Because they assumed it. Because they're like, Oh, let's assume the darkest thing possible. Then why was he- what was he staring at the grave for? Gary? Yeah, like, there- I noticed like a sequence where he's staring in front of a grave. You mean in the area that's literally graves? True. I have to say, there's a lot of points you stand in front of graves, too, but they aren't your graves! <laughs> yeah. Also, uh, Jiri. Um. Yes! But, uh, later tonight at 9 o'clock, uh, I'll be playing Bad Dream Fever. I still find it funny that Pokemon allows Missing No to be canon. I don't know why they made that canon. <laughs> yeah, if there's. I believe, like, it's been stated that almost every Pokemon game has Missing No in it ever since people brought it up. It's just that a secret little teeny area you have to find and you can see Missing No. You can't interact with it. Or catch it, but it's there. <laughs> and I love it. Of I love how. You love it. <laughs> okay, now where the fuck do I need to go? Oh, wait. I need to take out my strongest Pokemon first. Switch. Wait, what item are they holding? I guess I'll see in a summary. Okay. They're holding a tomato berry. A self-defense pill! <laughs> okay, fat bucks and drug addict. <laughs> Angie's well, holding, holding an apricorn. That means they're holding it, not using it. Owo oh, well, has soft sand. <laughs> and Nom has a qualot berry. Okay, what were those items that I caught? Got that. Yeah. 
our expert bell it, it is one a slight boost is the power of super effective moves I'm gonna give this my strongest Pokemon why because it boosts their power super effective moves <laughs> So now they are stronger. Wait, why was why was that one Pokemon holding onto deep sea scale if it helps Clampy instead? Uh, it helps them evolve, and uh, don't question it. It's like I am a sword. I have also given you an item that will help one of your other Pokemon evolve. Totally unrelated to me, as you do. If you want, you can lay traps around your base to prevent your friends from easily sneaking in. <laughs> you have to pay five grand for a secret base. <laughs> quite a bit. Oh. That's a secret base right there. Never mind. I'm just trying to figure out where the fuck to go. Oh, wait. I didn't, re I didn't see those patches of grass. So it's, I, it's probably by the book on nursery. Not nursery. Daycare, where Pokemon fuck each other. That has to go. Uh, I don't think they say it in that specific detail. I think they just, uh, tote over that part and go that they're, uh, having sandwiches together or something. There was a Pokemon game where you can see, like, um, it wasn't too graphic. But it was a Ditto and a Snorlax mating. It's an actual thing. In in one Pokemon game, I don't know what it is, but you can literally see it happen. And I don't know why they added it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so yes. <laughs> they know. <laughs> like there was no reason to add it. Oh wait, I wonder. I feel stupid. What? I can just surf. I forgot I can surf. That's probably what, what I need to do. I am now a Lapras. Fear me. Right. Yes. Why is there an Espeon in the lake? <laughs> You're not asking why there's whales on the trees, but you're asking why there's an Espeon on the water? <laughs> yes! Watch something more ridiculous pop out of the water. <laughs> this is... this is a slug Bloody! Pokemon! Oh no, they're cute! Wait, I don't think slugs do well with water! <laughs> Slugs live in the ocean! Oh, that's right. Why'd you run away from Gooby? They were so cute! Because I don't have any Pokeballs. This mean I would have to kill it. Oh no. What's this? I see the cutest version of Gooby that is clearly not the original coloration. And you can't even catch it. Will you ever see it again? I can't. I found a TM that's just called Dragonify. Oh, okay. is, is it a TM that forces Pokemon to be dragons? <laughs> dragon blood corrupt Dragon Blood corrupts the foe and turns it into the dragon type. <laughs> so, oh. so you're just making your Pokemon bleed on top. <laughs> I think it's 
more like your your Pokemon creates dragon blood and forces it into their enemy. <laughs> it's signed, instead of it telling me what the building is, it says, keep out. I want to go in. Door is locked and rusty. Nobody has been here for a long time. Damn it! 